Check out that dude on the TV. Man, he looks like a pretty stout runner. <laughs> Well, since I wasn't able to go on my run today because of the crazy ice, we have an ice storm that the trees are iced over. Right now, I'm uh, making a fort with Declan, and we're sitting by the fire. Here's the fort Declan and I made. We even got a little campfire inside. Let me give you a tour of our of our fort. All right. It's dark in here, but we'll see. Ah. Here's the campfire. Tiny, a tiny the camera. Oh no. I don't know if it'll see, if we'll be able to see anything. This is our fort. We got our Avengers mural wall. What do you think? Is it pretty cool? Yeah. Yeah. So we're just hanging out for a little bit. Hey. Hey, Catherine. 14 and then Hey. After 14 comes what? Money. Hey. Close the door. Fifteen. There we go. Fifteen. Careful. Mommy. Mommy's in here. Yes, fourteen and then fifteen. So, obviously I'm not in the woods right now, you know, bushwhacking. But I tried. <laughs> Got it this morning. I could see the ice on the trees. And looked on Facebook and saw plenty of reports of, you know, roads being closed. I tried. I took the all-wheel drive vehicle. Uh, this van right here, it's all-wheel drive. Took it out, made it about a mile and a half down the road. Did a couple of traction tests. Like, you know, accelerating quickly, braking quickly, you know, from slow speed. And just, you know, slipped. No traction. So, made the call to uh, turn around and go back home. It wasn't worth it to you know, drive like 30 miles in that nonsense towards the direction of the really bad ice. Now I'm on the treadmill. Uh, I've got about an hour and a half run today, but I figured I would do some uh, elevation. So I'm climbing right now at 20% incline. Pretty easy pace. I'm at like an 1811 right now. And then honestly, I haven't done any serious, you know, treadmill elevation in a while so it'll be good get some treadmill vert i'm just watching a uh, documentary on the bob graham round uh, about christina christina something <laughs> a woman's attempt at the uh, fkt so keep on trucking all right hopefully you can see me it's not too bouncy but i'm uh, about four and a half miles in just under an hour uh, a little over 2,300 feet of elevation gain. So I've been doing like a mile and a half flat, a mile at 20%, a mile flat, a mile at 20%, and now I'm just going to cruise for a little bit. So I get done running and now it's her turn. <laughs> Say hi. And no, that is not an <laughs> that is not an announcement. We are not pregnant. It's just an old shirt she made when she was pregnant and running a uh, Ragnar race. Watching Black Mirror. Go Valen! Woo! Alrighty, well I ended up with about eight miles, maybe just a little bit over eight miles. Didn't do any more elevation, so it was still that uh, it was like 2361. Uh, just a good, easy pace run with some good elevation, so it was good. Uh, tomorrow I've got some fart licks, hopefully, but I'm probably going to be stuck on the uh, treadmill again because it's supposed to snow and uh, give more ice today. Hopefully, we don't have trees fall with the weight of ice. So we don't lose power again. Uh, that would just be nasty, you know, hoping the power stays on. But I don't want to drag out that generator again. That's such a pain in the butt. I guess I should uh, <laughs> I should look at it as good cross training. I appreciate you all for hanging out. I wish I had some cool trail footage for you like I had hoped, but just didn't work out today. So anyway, I'm sure you can hear the kids upstairs being crazy because they're stuck inside also because it's ice, <laughs> ice, 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 
Ice, ice, baby. There we go. Okay. Um, anyway, so if you want to take a look at uh, the Frozen Head video I put together, that one right there, it's going to be on this side of your screen. You can take a look at that. And then I'll put a playlist up of some gear reviews you can check out over here as well. So go check out one of those and hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, and don't forget, live stream Thursday night, 8 p.m. Central. I'll see you then.